Hello, my name is Wendy Tran, certified health coach and founder of HealthyLittleBaby.com. And today we're here at the Eco Boutique at the Sanctuary in Los Angeles, California. And I wanted to talk to you about toys to build cognitive skills in toddlers. I have some wonderful toddler toys here. I'm a mom of a 16 month old and he is busy and it seems every day he's learning more and his language is developing and his motor skills as well as his fine motor skills. And it's really important to understand that to foster cognition in your toddler, you have to be engaged with your toddler. The easiest and quickest way to get them into a pattern of learning is to demonstrate how to use these fun toys. Because as they see you use these fun toys to match shapes and colors, they're going to mimic that. And a lot of times if you leave them to play on their own after you've showed them how to use these wonderful little toys, you will notice that sometimes they just get it in the right hole because it was an accident and they learn from that. Another great way to build cognition is to introduce music really early and have some musical toys around the house. And even if you can't afford really wonderful toys to have at home, do not fret because music is a great way to build cognition as well. Music is very rhythmic and it's also very repetitive. And especially if you use some of the really lovable childhood favorites such as Twinkle Twinkle Little Star and you twinkle your stars and you make your diamond in the sky, you really are going to encourage those fine motor skills, especially with things like Itsy Bitsy Spider. Really, really great way to encourage your child to learn and grow even if you don't have toys or even if you're just out and about. Sometimes in the grocery store, when my little one gets out of sort, we just start twinkling our stars and it settles him right down. So if you can, just keep a few things on hand for them to match shapes and colors and size. This is also really great for screwing, but as I mentioned, and as you moms probably know, a lot of times the toys don't get played with as much as the boxes. When my little one sees a water bottle, he goes straight for the screw cap. Of course, I have to keep an eye on him because it could be a choking hazard, but they just love exploring and touching and filling the things in their new world. So stay engaged with your child. I'm Wendy Tran, the baby pro, and I'll see you next time.